What's up everybody? It's Pump Mother Monday and you know it. Hey, beautiful weekend. Hope you guys enjoyed that video with Joe. The lovely Sarah is with us today. What's your shirt say? You don't know, do you? I have no idea. It's your Duke NCAA National Championship shirt. There you go. Go Duke, right? Yup, it was the first shirt out of the drawer. And look at this. <laughs> So. Look at it, just sitting, <laughs> just sitting there doing nothing. I did pick him up off the side of the road once. <laughs> Look at that old hat. What's that hat say, Walker? Yeah. <laughs> Gosh, dude, don't you have any other hats? Uh, I like this one. I get attached to things. <laughs> yeah, things get attached to him too. But he's got to go to the doctor for those. Anyway. <laughs> We're at our Wednesday property on a Monday because these folks called me and said, hey, we've got family coming in from Italy. Can you come out and do some work? So we're going to get plenty of footage for you. It's probably going to be boring, but hey, Dr. Rill's in the house, so enjoy. You don't have to do it. We do. Let's go. You know, I wanted to just sit in the truck like I always do, but daggone it, I had to do some work today. It's unbelievable. Eh, you have that sometimes. Guys, we're going to do a lot of trimming here, so instead of just getting down pulling these weeds, we're going to take them right down to the dirt. It's the quickest way to do it for us. It's such a big place, so. And then we'll go back and spray later, but, uh, Let's go to work.
Okay. Oh man, that's a little steep of a hill. We're gonna be doing the backside here of it. It's dusty out today. So we're gonna do this little area. Nothing much. Justin's up there blowing everything off, and then we're probably gonna attack that little hill there. Yeah, the mowing, man, again, it's starting to slow down. I've already gotten several calls this weekend for people to uh, have me skip, but uh, hey, we start aerations next Monday. We'll get plenty of that footage, and I want to talk about aerating. Might as well do that now. I mean, how many of you aerate? Now, that's one thing I've noticed. A lot of guys say, I don't aerate. And I, and I always say, why? It's, uh, first of all, it's beneficial for the yard. You're allowing water and oxygen to get down into the yard, into the ground. So it creates a stronger, stronger, uh, stronger lawn I think I didn't I didn't think that in the beginning when I started because I thought well ah, does it really make a difference and uh, man I, I trusted in it one time and after that I, I just bought I was all in I have seen yards transformed from garbage to beautiful thick lawns because of aeration so I'm all in on aeration I think you guys should be too you know do a little research but it's easy to aerate it wears you out if you don't have a, a riding aerator which I don't but uh, I'll tell you what it's great exercise it's great for the yard and it's a selling point for the customer man it's a Hold on. There's dust everywhere out here. It's just a great, let's be honest, we're out here to make money and it makes money. Aeration is a great way, it's a great tool to make extra income. So how do you charge for aerating? Well, that's the, that's what everybody has a problem with. Now what I do is I always double the price of my mowing. If it's 35 to mow, it's 70 to air rate. If it's 40 to mow, it's 80 to air rate. A lot of people do it by the square foot. I've never been really into measuring out yards. Now, a lot of people do. If you do, let me know how you do it. And uh, I just think it's really all around a good practice to get into. And I do it in the spring and the fall for the healthiest yards that I have all get done in the spring and the fall. And you guys have seen some of them, they're really beautiful. So anyway, let's get back to trimming and uh, I'll try to get some more footage for you. Let's go to work. guys so we got the walkway all cleaned off all the way up you can see the areas where we cleaned out right in here the dead ferns were there cleaned out over there cleaned all that up back here got that hill done you saw that cleaned out in here oops sorry cleaned out in there and cleaned out over there all the way up the hill and that is a hill, trust me. So, 
we're getting her we're getting her done but uh we got uh let me do something there we go we got a few more things to do in the front what's up man what's up everybody what's going on tired a little bit yeah this is rough going up and down hills it is all day it's pretty steep so it's down 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 Yep. Oh my gosh, why do I even try? <laughs> anyway, let's go up there, finish. Oh, sorry. Got my little. This is his gift now. I'm giving this to my employee. He's got him a ninja hat now. I would say he qualifies as a ninja, but we'll have to ask Nick. Whoa. Coming up under this stuff. Anyway, let's go upstairs or up top and let's finish this up. All right, guys, that is it. We are done for the day. I'll show you what else we got done. We worked out here for about five and a half hours and uh, got some stuff done. So customers happy. That's all that matters. We were here last uh, Thursday or Friday, I think Friday. So got all this cleaned out. There was some bushes growing up in there. We got that out. Got that all cleaned out. All the way down behind. And all the way up. And that hill. Show you over here. Got this all cleaned out. Back in there. And all that up there. So... And then what you just saw was uh, right in front of the garage. So, yeah, we, uh, the elusive weed. We got quite a bit done today. Hey, I wanted to do, kind of kill two birds with one stone, the military moment and a shout out to my boy from Tactical Lawn Cuts, Aaron still in the army getting out later this year and he wants to start a lawn business so guys go over to tactical lawn cuts grab him up tell him dr real sent you and uh show him some love man really a hero honestly but uh guys thanks for watching today i hope you enjoyed it i certainly didn't enjoy doing it <laughs> But, uh, hey, nothing wrong with good hard work. We'll see you tomorrow. I'm out of here. Dr. Real was in the house. Keep it real. Peace.